Hello YouTube, once again, you have to enjoy my delectable entertainment once more. Uh, this is Brundas08, reporting once again for duty, and yes, I am joined by none other than my brother again, because I am having to share at home. It's not my fault you need to use my equipment to record. Yeah, well, yours has it installed, because you're such a keen Let's Player. I am um, indeed. I'm Christopher Brown 1988 How do you all do? Again. Um, anyway. Straight on to matters, because obviously we've got a lot to get through today, after I said last time. The portal takes us through to Summer Forest after getting a 100% completion on Gateway to Glimmer. <laughs> Simples. Uh, yes, we sort of glitched it a little bit, but that means we do not ever have to come back here. <laughs> that makes you sound like you yeah. hate the level. Well, it's the tutorial level more than anything else. So, uh... Anyway, get going, get going, get going. In Summer Forest... Hey, Vegeta. We're going into a forest. Yes, Nappa. <laughs> I don't... I like... can swim. Belly flop. <laughs> Wait, how the fuck did he get there? Oh, no. Pick up her. And it's Faro. Oh, hello. We didn't get a chance to introduce ourselves before. My name is Alora. Uh, hi. Alora the Fauna. What are you, some kind of goat? Hmm. I'm a fawn, you dork. Oh, oh sorry. sorry. <laughs> Did you meet the gym cutters in Glimmer? Yeah, they gave me a souvenir, too. They called it a talisman. They gave you a talisman? What? Is it special? I just stuck it in the guidebook you gave me. How'd you know? There are 14 talismans in Avalar, <laughs> and they are all magical. If you can collect enough of them, they can be used to defeat Ripto. Where were you in the level? Hunter, where have you been? I, uh... Got a little lost. You're a Spiral cheater! <laughs> Wait, so am I! Two up, two down, left, right, left, right, B, start! That's a castle. Could have fooled me. Convince or forcefully persuade. <laughs> hey, I could do that. Why doesn't the dragon just torch Ripto? Touché. Hunter, you can't even keep track of your running shoes. How you... can we trust you with 14 oh. talismans? Oh, 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 get the water. You've just been burned. If you come across any orbs, they're important too. But I'll tell you about them later. Okay, no problem. I'll collect a few talismans, give Ripto the old hot foot, and be in Dragon Shores by lunchtime. Sounds like a pretty I wish good... I could do the same with Spain. Do my what? jobs and then be in Spain what by lunchtime. Is, what is your fascination with Spain? It's bloody well warmer than here! Ladies and gentlemen, let it be known that if Michael ever wins the trip on a holiday, he will pick Spain as his ideal location. Now we have two lives here. Lives are these blue butterflies, which oh, yeah. sparks will match. Butterfly cannibalism! <laughs> I think we found the episode title if you keep killing things. Okay. Oh, uh, ah! Like that. Butterfly cannibalism. Eh, not my fault. Now, as you see, Spyro makes it very easy to grab. Uh, Sp uh, Spyro. Spyro grabs gems a lot easier with Sparks in tow. Now, if you grab yourself an extra live one, it will automatically give Sparks a full life point recovery. So, if you have a green Sparks or no Sparks, this is your uh, grabbing a full life will give you a full gold one back again. Which, in other words, makes it to a ah, life oh. What? Hey, hey, ah. oh. hey, yes. Ah. Oh. Michael, just, just. Swim. I want to swim. Swim, swim, swim. You swim, technically swim. are swimming. Not swimming, swimming. What's the difference? Swimming, swimming is where you're swimming underwater. Sheep, sheep. Bah! Napa says kill sheep. Oh shoot! He found an extra life already. Wait, well, hey, couldn't do that again. Well, you probably can later. Oh, hi, Laura. Hey, Laura the Fauna. Spyro, this is the homeworld called Summer Forest. There are portals to many of the Avalar worlds. Reminds me of Sherwood. Unfortunately, Ripto has taken over the castle, and we need your help. Start by retrieving the talismans from each of the worlds you go to. Really? So, in order to basically progress the story, you must at least visit every single level in the game, and at least complete it to find the talisman. Now, as Alora said in the cutscene, there are 14 of them in the game. Now, I'll let... I'll put, I'll put it like this. 
To access the boss room, yes, froggy. there are bosses. Froggy, 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 froggy. Big will kill you for this. Oh, froggy. Oh, oh no, froggy. <laughs> Basically, um, in order to activate the boss rooms, you need to grab the talismans. And I think you can guess that you need all 14 of them to access the final boss. Simple. Uh, right. Yeah, you just completely cheat what you're supposed to do there. Leave the sheep alone! But I want lamb chops! Barbecue! You know what? I think we found the alternate title of this video. Destroy. No, Welsh hater. Sparks, the no, oh, there we go. You around is your health indicator, Spyro. The brighter he is, the more hit points you have. Easy. There you go. He basically, Zoe just explains it all. Leave that! It was in the way! Okay, so as we mentioned before, um, as you see, there are there are other portals to other areas. What you need to do is visit the mall to grab the talisman at least. How much treasure and orbs you grab in the level is pure optional at this stage of the game. Obviously, to grab the power-ups and progress later on, you will need the treasure. So, in other words, it's basically the old grab whatever you can find. Twenty-five. Oh. Uh, Hi, money bag. Did I just say, yes, we have our big, belovable. He's our big, bearded, brown, butching bear. Really? Wow, that was quite good for me, actually. Oh, dear. Uh, uh, sorry, Spyro. I'd love to teach you how to swim underwater. Hmm? But not as much as I'd love to take your treasure. So basically, this is Moneybag saying his own way of. Oh! Damn sausage! You need to have certain treasures in the game. Now I'll say this, as you progress in the game, there are limitless boundaries to how much he wants. And they sort me... of get more and more as the usefulness goes along. Oh, go find Hunter. Go, go play with Ah, oh, yeah, we'll, we'll talk to our cheater. I can get. Hi, Spyro. Hey, can get. You look like you're pretty agile. Let's try. Yes, I'm a dragon. A... I can fly. First step. Press X and hold. And hold it down to get more hang time. Hang time. You well, can't mess this up. I can't reach. Eh. Okay, I can reach. <laughs> okay. Not bad. Now what? To make this next jump, you'll have to glide. So glide. Just, just do please. Do the normally. Or you could just. Nice job. Now I did actually have to glide at the end. Now do a hover. Now they're saying you press the triangle to get an extra hover, and he can do it normally. Or you could just do that. Still put the hover in at the end for a bit of grace. Now comes the final bit. Over there. Very good. Now for the hardest leap of all. You'll have to give this one everything. No, I won't. Get a walking start, jump, glide, and hover just before you get to the edge of the platform. Don't forget to press forward on the D-pad or analog stick when you hover. And how many fourth walls are we breaking here exactly? I'd say many. Wow. Simples. Good athlete. Well, of course I am. I'm a dragon. For now, here's an orb for your collection. Oh, I'll, I'll have that off you. Yes. Now, as you can see here, the whole world has orb challenges as well, but some orbs are not as challenges. Okay. Where uh, do you think oh, we should? Talk again? Hmm? I'm just taking a break right now. Ha. Ocean, Ocean Speedway. Mm -hmm. Oh now what could that... Are you going to try and do the cheat way for another orb? No, actually, I'm going to go and annoy our friends at Colossus. Oh, and we get to see a cutscene. Because all these nice levels have a nice little cutscene for a before and after. So let's go and annoy... 444! You said it on 444! Couldn't do that again. Right. Anyway, so we're flying to our first destination. Colossus! <laughs> well, I think by that one we can understand who the Yeti was supposed to have, but he didn't have for dinner. Jokes. So let's go see the monk. 
A yeti has been rampaging around our home, but we've managed to trap him by shutting all the doors. If you talk to the other brothers, they will open the gates and guide you to him. Simples, yes? No. Now let's go play with the goat. Oh wait, he's talking again? Uh oh, look out! Ow! You got bopped by the goat! I'll bop him! Pingu is sad! <laughs> We do not endorse the murder of innocent penguins. Crunk will kill us though if he does. <laughs> oh. You're not very good at this. Are it you? was Billy Goat's fault. Uh, no, next game. <laughs> Ooh, gem. Ooh, that would have been fun because this game is notorious for one thing. A gem. Well, basically no. missing gems. Anyway, off we go. By concentrating, I should be able to open this door for you. Or you could just push the switch behind you. Ooh, I, uh... Look at that! Wow, amazing. How'd you do it? The door's open. Leave me alone. I'm trying to meditate. Oh, sorry. Fine. Bugger off. I was going to give you a flame, uh, a marshmallow, but anyway. <laughs> Look out! Ooh! The yak! <laughs> Ah. Da, 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 da. Try turning the camera with the L2 or R2 button. Fatty. Now the big ones, as you can guess, are only killed by flame. Because if you run into them when you're doing roly poly, then you'll get flat. Yeah, you'll be as flat. You'll be as flat as a. Ah. Table. Like that. Like that. And then he jumps over my corpse. <laughs> like he's going tra la 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 tra la 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 By the way, what's with these weird Buddha statues? Who needs a key when you know how to chant like this? Do you wanna join us, Michael? Why I I why Amazing! You have powers. How am I supposed to achieve enlightenment if you keep pestering me? God, you're horrible, you lot! It's like you do your job and then you. Oh, hello. Enemies like those yaks are too big to Oh, here we go. Zoe will explain it. Simples. Easily take care of large enemies. So, this is basically for those who can't be bothered to figure out pressing the circle button. Help. Ah! Go up to the gate, right? We'll show how it works. Yeah, go, go yes. to the gate and we'll show how the power up yes. works. Now. Oh, let's let Zoe do it. Each time you defeat an enemy, it will release a spirit particle. The spirit particles will activate the power-up in that world. If a power-up is inactive, you need to defeat more enemies. Goku wants his spirit bomb. <laughs> oh, look out! Wait, I'm quite impressed. He's not very accurate if he aimed for a brick wall. Good try. Now the problem with this game sometimes, as we mentioned, was about the gem. Now, the reason we say this is because there are some levels with gems in such hidden spots that it's quite hard to find them all. So That's what makes the game the game. That's true. The exploration, the challenges, the fun, the... the uh, I don't know, what other words would you say for it? I'm doing well. Hey! I wonder look. what's with the Buddha statues. I'm sure we'll find out. Hey, look what I can do! <laughs> Whoa! Ah. Ah. Amazibus! It's called buttons! Magicians do it all the time! Not one. Are you referring to what I think you're referring to? Our favourite man from Bradford. Yes. Dynamo! Yeah, for those who don't know Dynamo, make sure you watch the videos and see how his magic trick works. He's amazing. Type him in on YouTube. Hello? Remember Hunter's advice? You will <laughs> run farthest if you press the X button at the oh, very wait. top of your jump. Remember Hunter's advice? Hang on a minute, what happens if you enter this level BEFORE you talk to Hunter? You're probably going, who the fuck is Hunter? Hunter! Hunter! Not Hunter! Hunter is a Pokemon! Sorry, blame me, I watched Nintendo... <laughs> Back attack. Cheesy goats. Not ghost cheese, cheesy goes. So we need 11 to activate the power up. The power up for each gate is exactly the same. Ow! Yeah, kill Die! Me. Oh, look, a yak! Let's go kill it. No, let's Hover. go. Hover! Kill it! 
Flame rump. Flame rump. Flame grill. Uh, so something, something to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> you appear to be fun to be the dragon. It's murdering goats. Murdering goats is fun. Is that really as far of a joke as we possibly have got? I couldn't possibly tell you. By the way, we need the power up in order to activate the... Oh, crap. Oh, wait. Never mind. So this is the super jump. By running into the thing, you will jump high into the air and you will set yourself flying high. Super spring. Got that one. Yeah, to be honest, so did I, actually. Uh, oh! Oh. Even though I'm a vegetarian, I think you should kill that yeti. He's pretty tough, though. In fact, I'm not so sure... Wait a minute! Look! There's a typo error! Brother Ned said... Wait, what did he say? He said, I think you should kill that yeti! Look! Oh. Oops! Insomniac! Oh, talk to him again. I think he says something. Even oh, though yeah, listen. Vegetarian, I think you should kill that yeti. He's... See? Ha-ha! <laughs> well, now we come to our first boss fight of the game. Yeah. Get ready, because this boss fight is actually really difficult. Come on! Come on, I'm ready for you! Or rather... Huh? What? NOT! You stupid... I thought the Yeti was tougher than that. I guess he was all bark. <laughs> anyway, I was just guarding our sacred talisman to make sure the Yeti didn't eat it. Eating. So he just passes it straight to you. Well, that's pretty easy enough. Here is a present from me to you. And it goes ding. It makes a ding noise. Ding. So, ah. <laughs> and he does nothing else. You were expecting him to run through the portal, weren't you? No, I was not. Uh, so which way are you going to go first? I I'm going to go on this ledge out here. Yes, now this is another level where there's more to the level than meets the eye. Don't! Please don't! What? More than meets the eye. You don't know the mm. joke. You know the joke, don't you? Robots in disguise. That's the one! So as you can see, Spyro can also ice skate. How the fuck did you learn all of this? He's a purple dragon. But now we come to the challenge. It's quite a hard one. Spyro, welcome! We have found that hockey is a peaceful and calming sport. Really? Like to join in <laughs> have you watched the Canadians? <laughs> the Canadians and the Americans go it like hammer and tongs. Tongs. Try a game against a goalkeeper. Yeah, why not? I have two minutes to score five in the red. Okay. And there is their goalie. Didn't realise he was the same size as the house. So here's how it works. Give me puck, the give goalie me is ah. programmed to follow that hockey puck as much as you possibly can. I need the puck. What so are you, you looking go? at, hockey puck? So you go to the hockey puck and you've got to get your angle right and hopefully get it in the goal, Michael. He rotates around. He shoots and he misses again. He yeah. rotates again. Right. Ah! I think it's fair to say that Canada will not be looking for you. No. It's only 30 seconds, and you haven't even scored one. Normally, I've scored by now. Oh, no. No, no. Oh, See, I know how to score in my net. Yes. Yeah. That's one. Are you scored it at 117 dead? Oh, I'm quite good. Good. I don't know. It looks like a dead number. Where the fuck are you? There you go. Ah, meets it on the round. Now, the problem with he this... He rounds one. He rounds two. He rounds three, he rounds four, and he misses again. It's going round again though, and he swings it round, and it's in. He scores. And I'm sure the Canadian it. viewers, if there are any on your channel, are probably looking and thinking, how the fuck does he know all of this? Goal. You have 50 seconds to score three goals. Uh, oh, he's to the left, and that's 47 dead. To the left. Yeah, that was 47 dead. Yeah. To the left, to the left. Every goal is better when you aim to the left. <laughs> that wasn't bad. That actually wasn't bad, actually, coming up with that. Nice shot! Long range. You have a play Four th in 33. You've got 30 seconds for one goal. Easy peasy. Now, the problem with you're on the ice, though, that we should probably mention is you can't stop. You, you can't, can't stop, you can't jump, you can't move. But you can, well, you can move, but... Play, oh, right. no! Uh, uh, no, no, oh, no, 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 come back, come back here. I need the puck, I need the puck. You've puck, got puck. ten seconds. Ah, 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 Nine, eight, seven, oh, shit. six, no, five, no, three, two, one, game. Oh, I was going in. You must 
Focus your thoughts to succeed, Spyro. Oh, Captain Cabbage! Uh, yes, I would like to try again. Are we really... Do you want to do anything here? Suppose we best. Alright. In which case, guys, we'll see you... Uh, we'll see you after this challenge is done. That is, if Michael gets it done before the video is done. We only have a few minutes. Before. He tucks it left. He tucks it left and scores. Or we could just let the whole thing play, because I think you're going to do a lot better now. Well, I'm not going to fuck about this time. Oh, I, I said the F word. <gasps> oh, wait. Jew? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's talking about... You can't say in school, you f***ing... Ready, flip that! Oh, and in fact, you've got another guest. Oh, my dog's arrived. Hello, doggy, doggy, doggy. Anyway. I want to fuck... <laughs> what are you staring at, Mr. Hucky Puck? <laughs> what are you looking at, you hockey fuck? Oh. Nice job. <laughs> hey Canada, you watching? <laughs> now, now. Oh, oh, what an interception! Interception! Ah, oh, that was coming. And you fucked it up. That was, in fairness, I didn't know where to bleed and go on that one. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh god. Oh dear. Oh, dear. Are you dear really me. gonna mess this up now? No. Viewers, place your bets! Think you can think you can do it? Yes! 46 you took 46, 46! I'm getting good with these round numbers, aren't I? You're getting good with certain numbers. Fuck you, fuck you. And we'll go for the win. On a long range, and he's not got it. Uh, oh, you are an ass! Well, is this really the time to show off? Yes. You are an LP, yes, but... Ha. Oh! Oh, no! And showing off gets you where, viewers? <laughs> oh, but yeah, LP curse! LP curse! Yes! He went too far wide! Yes! He's got it! 1066! 1060, actually. Well done! And you finally did it, so I guess uncut! <laughs> oh, God. Try a game of... One on one? Yeah, it's easy. First of five wins. Yeah, okay, we'll do that. Now, as you see at the bottom, there's a difficulty rating. This is a three out of five. So basically... Oh, well, we know who, the, who they didn't do. You can barbecue. Ah. Oh, there's your goalie. By the way, in case you... Oh! By the way, in case you wondered, the goalies are exactly the same. You know, unfortunately, they are a lot more accurate. <coughs> Grab that puck! Oh, that was a nice attempt, but I think he got it back! Oh, no, he didn't! Or not. Oof! Nice! Ah! What all, folks? Come on! Die! Oh, I missed! <laughs> Should I add the Wario clip there? That nearly worked better than I hoped. Oop. You were nearly hoping to get a goal by axe by pure accidental luck. And we swing it, and we swing it back. Yeah, just look out for him. Where is he? Oh! Ah! <laughs> the problem with this one is the fact he is very, very good with his defending. Because concerning the fact that you can't block. Could be here. What? <laughs> oh. Come on! Four minutes on the... Uh, not four minutes, uh, six minutes on the midline. Oh, interception! Yeah, good luck getting round him. Nice! <laughs> hey, Spring. those who play ice hockey, have a look at Michael's skill and tell him if you think he has what it takes to be part of the, of the team. Oh, cap... Oof! <laughs> he came out of nowhere! I know, uh, left field? Right field? I don't know. What, what would you really classify? Nice! Oh, you're dead! Uh. Oh. <laughs> and the guy said this was peaceful? I hate to say what he thinks is. Uh, uh oh! No, 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 uh, wait, what do you want from him? Whoops! Uh, Where the hell is it? 
Over there. Ah! No. Nice! <laughs> oh no. I didn't mean to do that. It uh oh! It backfired on you, that one! Oh, cabbage leaves! Let's see, uh. Ice hockey players? I, I don't really know any ice hockey players to make a joke. Uh, come here. Oops! Ha ha ha! Nice! Four! Two, four! 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 Ha! Ah. First at golf! <laughs> ah, I have no sympathy for you, Red. Red vs. Blue. I was waiting for that one. Where are you? <laughs> Ow! Really? How cruel can you be? Uh. Well, that's fast as that pup's ever moved. He's right behind me. Uh oh! And you finish? Nope, I think you got it back! Or not. Stop it. Your goalie is incredibly shit! Here's one passes straight- Oh oh! Fumble! Ah! And that! Well, is they well, say? This. That! Stared at it long enough, you might not see anything. Uh... Right, okay. Huzzah? I don't know whether that's a good thing or a bad thing. We're at 26 minutes, so do you want to stop for the mo- oh. Uh, we'll go... Well, I think we'll hold halt for there, for now, uh, and we'll continue this level. Yes, because we're not quite done yet, are we? We have a lot to do still. Uh, well, not quite a lot, but there's still a bit more. There's still a few more challenges, so on that note... It's... Uh, oh. It's goodbye from me, Chris Brown, 1988. And for the time being, goodbye from Brundas08. So, well, uh, we'll see you for the next one, I guess. I suppose. Alright. See you later, shitlords. Bunfluff!